Well, let's write this code um, with some files uh, to create um, a GIF from many PNG files. We would just want to use PowerPoint to be very fast and easy way to do it without wasting time. Let's go and we would just we want just to animate a simple um, simple way to say something through through animation. So we want to make um, just for this kind of topic that we are talking PNG PNG Okay, let's close this D here. Let's let's do okay. Let's imagine what you want to achieve at the end. You want to get more PNGs. This is a way to do GIF that explains what you are trying to explain. Right? PNG and it goes here to a to a GIF. GIF to me is something like this. Animated GIF. Well, you know what I mean. And let me just make it a little bigger. Okay. And all these ideas that are coming to my mind are the final result of something that can be in between until this and it goes here and it goes okay, goes here. Now this will be the last of uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, let's go fifteen. 15 15 frame okay so let's copy this and let's 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 now we're done now let's go back here and this this must decrease of 1 Let's put it here. Let's go here and one, two. Let's go here. Let's go to twelve. One, two, three, four, five. Let's go here. Let's go to eleven and one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen and let's go here and let's go to ten to ten this is gone okay this is a little behind to nine That's gone. This is more behind. This is gone. This is at the beginning. Now let's go here. These are gone. Now let's go here. These are gone and and this this is gone. Here. You can also do this. Copy this, go on to the fifth and copy it. And delete this. Well, but it's more complicated, so let's just go to here and delete this. Let's go to the fourth and delete this, 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 and this and and this
Let's delete all. To number two here. Let's delete all and let's make this one bigger. And more like here. And let's delete all and let's make this even bigger. I hadn't made this bigger. different PNG okay so now if we are going to see our animation here where it is okay nothing too complicated because we must go with things really quirky quickly and you you can then make your own thing more smoothly let's go and check our PNG right and then go into H and we go to our PNG GIF. Here is our folder where we have our code. Now we can call it wherever. Let's call the name frame. Let's save it. Now it will ask if you want to just every slide or just one slide. You see every slide. Okay, now it's gone. It's a good thing to save this presentation if you want to change something and you can also call it well, let's put it in here call it uh, PNG GIF, GIF now let's close this and okay we have the create GIF here the frames are here and well, I just put me put the code here. Okay, now we just if it's all right, you just have to click here, and this should be your the result should be this the gift file. Let's see if it worked. Okay, as usual, there are some problems with when uh, PowerPoint saves it because the, these numbers here after the 9 goes after 1 because it's 1, 0. Okay, let's solve this. You, you can solve it with Python, but for now, we just have to do, you know, 9A. And this let me put 9b nine C nine D nine E I made a program once for this. I'll show you next time. 9F and OK. Uh, let's delete this and let's run again the code. Ho hopefully, this now it will be good. OK, so it worked. It's just a simple example here. And 
that's all. That's how you can use this code. You see it works. And so I remember this code is on my post and uh, there it is. I copied and pasted into my um, Sublime text and it's very simple. It goes import uh, use image and image draw maybe it's not even um, you don't even have to use it but so it creates a list and then it um, creates a list of all the files that you have uh, yeah just delete this frame here let me see it in here that made some changes let me go and check PNG GIF Okay, um, you don't need this image draw. And um, okay, you to get every frame here, you just have to put uh, this asterisk. This means every frame that ends with .png, and then you iterate through all the PNG in the um, folder. That will be first open it, and then and uh, you will call the the image object new frame and that this image object goes into the list frames and then all the frames will be converted in a gif here and you can change the duration and uh, okay you can change the duration right uh, the loop zero means that it goes on forever if you want just one loop, you give one or another number if you want more loop, zero if you want infinite loop. So that's all.